And I'm going to sing a couple songs that God has blessed in my spirit to sing with y'all. And I Amen. pray y'all join with me. Glory be to God. And we welcome all those that are online. Hallelujah. Here at Greater Jesus Tabernacle Church. We thank God for you joining us online. Hallelujah. There was a day when there was nobody online. When you couldn't watch. When you had to stay home. Or you had no choice. You couldn't make it. You didn't have a ride to get here. But we got technology now. Glory be to God. Where you can. With Jesus can reach you right where you're at, right on your phone, hallelujah, right on your computer, glory be to God, and we're thankful for our pastor, Pastor James Foster III, hallelujah, his wife, the lovely first lady, glory be to God, we thank God for our leaders and assistant pastor, hallelujah, Walter Hughes, Elder Walter Hughes, and all those that are here joining. If this is your first time here, wave your hand at me, hallelujah, glory be to God, we thank God, put your hands together for the visitor. Here, hallelujah, this Sunday morning. Hallelujah, we thank God for you. Heaven smile upon you. Keep blessing you. Keep coming, keep showing up. Glory be to God. We thank God. There's a lot of accent here today, but the Bible said, Where there's two or three gathered in my name, there am I in the midst. Yes. I see more than two folks up in here. So we get ready to bombard heaven and go before the throne of grace. Hallelujah. Father God, in the name of Jesus. Sweet, sweet Jesus. No other name like your name. So we lift up the name of Jesus so that all men, all women be drawn unto you today. We invite you in this place and we ask you to take over the atmosphere. Hallelujah. By way of the Holy Spirit, we welcome you in this place. Fall fresh on us today. Fresh anointing, God. Fresh ministries. Fresh preaching and fresh teaching, God. Hallelujah. Fresh playing on the instruments, Father. We ask right now for those that are absent, God, that had a mind to come out here today. They couldn't make it for whatever various reasons, God. You watch over them and keep them in your care, Father. Hallelujah. Bless their families, God. Bless them. Cover them, Father, with the blood of Jesus Christ. Those, Father, that are sick and afflicted, Father, that wouldn't make it here today, God. Father, we ask that Jehovah Rapha, our healer, God, the bomb of Gilead, will you reach down and touch their body right where they are, Father. Let the anointing power of the Holy Ghost, Father, your healing virtuous spirit, fall fresh on them right now, God. Father, for those, God, that weren't able to make it, Father, hallelujah, because of finances or whatever reasons, God. Father, let them know there's nothing too hard for you, Father. Open up doors that no man can shut. Shut doors that no man can close. We believe that all things are possible to them that believe. We trust in what you said in your word, Father. We thank you for all your promises, Father. Father, we thank you right now, Father, for those that God lost loved ones. Father, somebody's passed away to be with you, Jesus. You said in your word that to be absent from the body is to be present with you, Jesus. So they're in a better place, God. Hallelujah. No more suffering. No more pain. No more heartache, no more crying, God. They're with you, Jesus. And we ask that you give them families peace, God. Comfort all those that are mourning right now. Comfort, Father, in the name of Jesus. Let the oil of joy, joy, Father, for the spirit of heaviness be lifted right now in the name of Jesus. And Father, we thank you in the name of Jesus for what you're doing here at our church and pray to Jesus' tabernacle. How you're blessing our leaders, our pastors, the first lady, God. How you're blessing the ministry, God. You're doing a new thing with the family of God right here. Hallelujah in St. Joseph, Missouri. Continue to do a work in us, God. Increase our wisdom, Father. Increase our belief in our faith, Father. Increase our trust in you, Father. In the name of Jesus. And we thank you for your mercy. We thank you for your grace. You're so gracious. You're so faithful, Father. When we're faithless, Father, you're faithful all the time. Hallelujah. We thank you for your faithfulness. God, we pray that you continue to draw the backsliders. Hallelujah. The prodigal sons and daughters out there. Back home to the family of God. Whatever is hindering them, Father. Whether it be jobs or spouses or children. Or whatever is happening in the environment, God. God, break the yokes of bondage, Father. Set the captives free, Father. Open up their eyes to the truth in their ears, God. In the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you, Father, for 
order in our steps here today so that we can worship you in spirit and in truth, Father. In the name of Jesus, I believe today, God, in this hour right now, somebody can be saved. Somebody can be delivered. Somebody can be set free. Hallelujah. And we thank you for all those things, God. Thank you for your son, Jesus. How he died and he was buried and rose from the grave. We can't thank you enough for sending the comforter, our helper, in the name of Jesus. Have your way in the service today, in the mighty name of Jesus. God, we give you the glory for what you're doing in St. Joseph, Missouri. Hallelujah. Go into the prison cells, into the jail cells, the convalescent homes, the nursing homes. Walk up and down the aisles of the hospitals, Father. Hallelujah. We declare and we decree it right now that by faith we send the word right now around the world. We pray for revival around the world in the name of Jesus, God. Hallelujah. We speak to those dry bones all over the city, around the world. We speak to the dry bones. You shall live and not die in the name of Jesus. We speak to every suicidal spirit, depressive spirit. Hallelujah. God suppressing spirit, oppressed spirit, got to go in the name of Jesus. By the authority given to us by the anointing in the Holy Ghost, we speak to every foul, unclean spirit. You got to go in the name of Jesus. You're not wanted in the presence of God. And we thank you, Jesus, for the victory that you've given our people, your people, your sons and your daughters, your children in the kingdom of God. We thank you for the victory right now. In Jesus' name, anybody that loves the Lord, somebody put your hands together and give God some praise. Give Him glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Give Him glory. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Woo! God is good. You can take your seats if you want to. Glory to God. We're going to song, sing a song. Hallelujah. Because I was blessed. I was sitting there, let me tell you a quick story right quick. Uh, I was watching a movie on PG. I monitor some stuff my daughter likes to watch. We walking into a season right now. How many believe seasons is changing right now? Right before our eyes in the natural, but also in the spirit. So my daughter was watching, and I was watching this movie, but I was watching it first. And uh, it started off real good, PG, children movie. Started off real good, but then the little girl started dibbling and dabbling and doing potions and, you know, and conjuring up spirits and she wanted to be a witch when she got older. How many know that the devil is a liar? He tries to come in real subtle like and, and I was watching this little girl on the movie and she was conjuring up spirits. We in a season right now where we need to tell the truth to our children, amen? We need to tell the truth of what's happening right now with witchcraft everywhere where they celebrate Halloween, glory be to God. But the children of God that believe, stand on the promises of God, that God, let God be true. Romans 3, and every man alive. Because these things, God, we know that come in so subtle to try to hinder the family of God. You got to tell your children the truth. So I told my daughter, I said, baby girl, you can't watch that one right there because of the witchcraft that was forming and happening on that movie. You need to tell them the truth. So I'm saying to myself, what else, God, is going on in this world? And you know, I'm a mailman and I deliver, glory be to God, to every house and they don't know I my hands are anointed with oil. I'm blessing about 500 houses a day, walking 10 to 15 miles, blessing homes, and they have no idea. Glory be to God, but I'm looking for God to do great and mighty things in these last days. And you know, some people will come to you and tell you some things like this and ask you a question, what's your stance on abortion? What's my stand on abortion? And I tell some things like this, I'm so thankful when my mother had me at 41, she didn't give up on me. That's my answer. She didn't give up on me. And I'm so thankful Jesus didn't give up on me either. Hallelujah, all the way to the cross. 
into the throne. Jesus didn't give up on us. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. There's a song that we sang in church. Everybody can join in. We're so thankful to see the brothers and sisters that are here. Hallelujah. Mark your calendar, brothers. October 15th, we get together again for Real Men Talk. Hallelujah. Right here at our church. 10 p.m. till 6 o'clock in the morning. Whatever time you can make it, we're going to be here. October 15th is a Saturday. Runs into Sunday morning. Dressed, suited, and booted. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We're going to war for our families. We're going to war for our churches. We're going to war, hallelujah, for our city. We're going to war, hallelujah, for this world. Hallelujah. We thank God. Glory be to God. So when we was up here thinking about the goodness of God, I said, what shall we say? Many, many songs came to my spirit. And I said to myself, Lord, what do you want to say? Not me. What do you want to say? You got to acknowledge the Lord at all times. And at first I said I was going to say, blessed assurance, Jesus is mine. But I love them songs. How many grandmama, mother of Hughes, we grew up on some songs that kept us. Hallelujah. But I like to sing the scriptures. Bless the Lord, oh my soul. And all that's within me, bless his holy name. You can put your hands together, let's sing together.
tell God, I thank you, hallelujah, for blessing us with your holy name.
need to come to Jesus. I 